Hey guys, today with an abundance of HDR 10-bit videos, 4K Ultra HD videos, world is definitely looking out for an incredible, efficient and powerful video player that can give a breathtaking visual experience of the favorite videos. And for that, CNX player aided by Intel-based hardware acceleration is the best choice to watch your favorite videos on Windows 10 PC and Windows 10 tablet. Now, in this video, I'm going to take you through some features of CNX player that make it an impressive video player app available on Windows 10 devices. Okay, now this is the home screen. It doesn't have any videos to browse. Let's add some videos to the library. Let me choose a folder that has videos in it. Yeah, this is there. I do close. Okay, now the cool thing about CNX player is as you see on this right hand side, all the videos that were added in the folder will appear here with a small thumbnail. Isn't that cool? Now this is something really, really, really unique in CNX player. You will not see it anywhere else. If I want to see the information of the file, just do a right click and there you see the file information. You want to play from here, you can play it. You can, you can do other operations like you can delete it or edit the name of the video from here. Okay. This is the view options. Now right now it's a grid view. You can change the view to list view or to a folder view. Okay, let me keep it to the grid view. That's my favorite. Now that's a quick access bar. You can open the file from outside. Okay. So play from outside. You can manage the library from here. You can enter the edit mode. You want to delete the videos or edit the name of the file. Everything can be done from this screen. Or you don't want to go in the edit mode. You simply want to view the all collection. That's how you do it. Okay. Then this is the refresh button. You want to refresh the media library, the gallery. You want to search the video. You can search it by name. Okay, there it appears. And then another awesome feature of CNX you can play the video and in parallel to it you can view you can browse the media library that's one of the unique features of CNX player which no other video player offers as of now this is pretty cool and it makes CNX player really impressive now let's go to the full screen that's a child lock or you can say a screen lock. You can lock the window so you can't do any operations on the window. A very good feature if you are watching movies on your tablet or PC with a touch screen. Now let me unlock it. You know there are some controls on the top right. This one is playlist. You can create your own playlists. Okay. Now you want to add the videos. It's a place where you add. You can select the videos. They will be added. There it is. Yeah. And that's the full screen. That's the audio track. If your video has multiple audios, you can select from here. So that's where you can change the subtitles you can change the language of the subtitles there you go i changed it to french okay there are more things that you can do with the subtitles you can attach an external subtitle to the video you can change the settings you can change the alignment to top you can change the color can change the text size so cool 
things about the subtitle settings in CNX Player. Then that's where, okay, this is another cool thing, switching to a mini player. This is the place where I can move my video, my screen to a small screen and do other tasks and save my time. Watch the video parallelly, switching back to the full screen, click here. Okay, now there are more settings here. You want to select the loop option. You want to resize the video, you want to crop it or you want to stretch it. You want to change the playback speed. You want it in slow motion, shift to 0.5x. You want to watch it in fast motion, double it to 2x. Okay, CNX player allows you to change the contrast of the video. It allows you to change the saturation. This is something, again, very, very unique to CNX player. I can change, I can switch the decoders from hardware decoder to software decoder. By default, CNX player plays its videos with hardware decoders, which are more efficient. And then again, I can see the properties of my file, the details of the file. Some pretty cool on the screen. Now you want to skip the video, just double click on the right side, it'll skip by 10 seconds each. You want to back find by 10 seconds, double click on the left side. You want to skip forward or you want to go back, drag right and left. You want to you go from down to up. That's where the volume is controlled. You want to increase the brightness. You want to decrease the brightness. Go down. Double click in the center. It will take you to the small screen. You double click. It will take you to the full screen. Okay. CNX players High Performance Playback Core has a remarkable implementation of audio and video codecs. 4K videos and 10-bit HDR videos are really highly resource intensive and they need a cutting edge technology implementation for real buttery smooth video playback. CNX Player is powered by Intel software which gives a phenomenal visual experience on Intel based Windows 10 PCs and tablets. The hardware acceleration in CNX Player Core framework makes the video player even more robust and highly efficient. So the next section that we would like to see is the navigation menu. Okay, this is the upgrade features. Now you want to upgrade to professional video codecs, which is a 10-bit video codex. CNX player plays all the major video codecs for free, but to play 10-bit video codecs. You need to upgrade to the professional codex pack, which will include playback for 10-bit AGVC, 10-bit VP9, 10-bit H264. Now, upgrading to 10-bit video codec pack means you'll be able to experience more colorful videos, more color depth, and more clarity. This is if you want to remove the advertisement. Okay. This is the man open file, manage video library, playlist. Okay, now this is the streaming part of CNX player. CNX player supports popular HLS, MPEG dash, protocol, HTTP, <coughs> progressive streams. So all you need to do is you can copy the video streams and paste it here in the box on top. And there you go. That's where your video is going to be played. So this is a list of all the videos that have been played. You want to add videos to favorites, just click on the star. You will see these video links added to the 
favorites you want to create channels that's how you can create the channels channels is a list of videos a collection of videos you can see now let me add some videos to the channel so that i don't have to remember them again and again i will add this to a channel let's say to test 12 and that's where i go i see the list of channels now the streaming channels are an awesome thing that cnx player has come up with you got some series to watch or you got some video tutorials or anything which is of the same type you can have a collection of those streams and create a channel for them that's pretty cool i must try it out then again this is a refresh button these are the player settings change the theme cnx player offers multiple themes you can change them whichever you like okay you want to change the text settings the subtitle settings and okay this is something really important for us the recommend us button so if you really like CMX player it would really help us if you could recommend us review us on Microsoft store that would keep us motivated and give you a better even more enhanced video player with more features thank you guys